human respiratory system. Humans have a pair of nostril just above the lips which leads to nasal chamber through nasal passage. The nasal chamber opens into a cavity called nasopharynx. Nasopharynx open into trachea through glottis of the larynx region. Larynx is a cartilaginous structure at the top of the trachea contains elastic vocal cords that are the source of the vocal tone in speech. The opening to the trachea is through a structure called glottis. A thin flap of tissue called epiglottis prevents the entry of food into trachea during swallowing. The trachea is lined with mucous membrane. It traps any foreign particles. At the lower end, the trachea splits into two branches, the left and right bronchi. Each bronchi is then split to form secondary and tertiary bronchi and bronchioles. Each bronchiole ends in tiny spongy sacs called alveoli. The lungs are both encased in a double membrane called the pleura. The pleura protect and cushion the lungs. The path from nostril to the bronchioles constitutes the conducting part which transports the air to the alveoli and alveoli and its ducts form the exchange part of the respiratory system. On the lower side of the lungs, diaphragm is present. Diaphragm is a sheet of strong muscles lies at the bottom of the pleural cavity. The diaphragm is absolutely necessary to the respiratory system. Get doubt box on a device of your choice. We have education tablet, pen drive for PCs, SD card, smart TV apps and online versions available. Register today for a free trial and experience the new way of learning.